Hello guys, this is James from Golden Shiny Trading. In this video, I will introduce you three main markets in EU. So let's go to China first, and then we go to Eastern Province, Zhejiang, and then go to Jinghua City, where EU is one of Jinghua's administrative region. Now finally, we arrive EU City. As we can see from top right map, it's not a very big city, but it's very important city to China, even to the world in trade business. Now first, Market here is EU production materials market. This market mostly selling different types of manufacturing machines. Second is Huangyuan garment market, where you can purchase various ready-made clothes for every age people. Now time to go to today's topic, EU international market, also known as EU Futian market or EU commodity market. Look at these yellow push pins here. There are five districts from district 1 to 5. Okay, let me brief you guys one by one. This is district 1 that has 5 block from A to E. On the right is newly built district 1 east area. Next is district 2. That is F block. Next here is still district 2, but it's G block. We go up north a little is district 3. Now keep it up. Here is district 4. To the right, is district 5 check here okay totally five districts make up EU international trade market now you have a clear idea what comprised of this one of biggest markets in the world today we change F section to G section in district 2 let's take a look at the front door of district 2 pretty big and this is layout map for each floor on district 2 this is structure chart now here are three guided maps that show you where is where and you can find products and booths very quickly according to that. By watching this video, you will learn about the EU market. If you plan to visit the city for business or you want to learn more about trading in China in general, then you will get answers like below from this video. First, are all booths in the market operated by manufacturers? Most booths in the market are owned by manufacturers. Others are owned by trading companies which sourcing products from factories. If you do not want to buy in large quantity, you may get a better price from such trading companies rather than buying from factory because trading companies are more flexible on price and quantity sometimes. Two, where are these booths from? Some booths are owned by factories based in EU and nearby cities in Zhejiang province. Well, some are located in Fujian, Guangdong or other provinces. Three, how to get infos about supplies in EU market. If you are a first time EU visitor or do not have much important information and experience, distinguishing if a supplier is an individual business, small workshop or large factory will be challenging to you. Most booths will claim to be manufacturers but do not easily trust them at the beginning. However, not every customer want to find manufacturer. It depends on your product, quantity and uh, target price so find a proper supplier is way more important sometimes maybe trading company even more suitable to you welcome to contact us for more details for importing goods from eu china as a professional export company we can help you find good suppliers and the best price ship your goods to your country safely and punctually